Hi Aquarius, I hope that you're doing fantastic. Thanks for joining for your Scorpio season reading. So if you are returning, welcome back. And those of you who are brand spanking new, welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm just very spiritual, guys. I could come across religious and all that kind of stuff, but I'm really not. I do use living language and scripture, and I am asking at the hand of Jehovah Elohim, who is the maker and ruler of everything. Uh, people call him universe. He is he's everything. Okay, You can call him whatever you want. He's upright, righteous, and, and truthful, and I just keep the commandments, and uh, I acknowledge truth and love and um, all that kind of stuff. So anyway, if that's not something you're looking for, then I'm not going to be your channel. There's real talk on my channel. I get real down to earth, hard information sometimes. We look at the good, the bad, the ugly. I get a lot of legal stuff on my uh, readings. So it is what it is. And so if you stay welcome. All right, Aquarius, let's get in here and see what uh, the Spirit wants you to know about the Scorpio season. This is for Aquarius, Jehovah. I just inquire at your hand, and I just thank you for the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Just bind, block, and rebuke all negative, dry, wicked, dark energies and forces for the Aquarian energy. I ask for your wisdom, your knowledge, and your understanding to come forth. You know all things, Jehovah. Thank you. Give me just a second. I've been feeling some strange energies. If you are new, I feel energy. And sometimes just come across so strange. And I was feeling that way. Um, really, really feeling it on Sagittarius' reading. Okay? I was really just feeling it. Um, this is your past. Okay? This is what's hidden. And this is what's going to come to the surface. Okay? In the season. Okay? Love is the answer has come up in every reading so far. That's it's, it's, it is the answer, people. But there's no other freaking way, man. I mean, it just ain't gonna happen or work for anybody uh, to get what they need or want unless you're gonna walk in a place of love, people. All right. So if you always keep coming out here and saying love is a freaking answer, love is a freaking answer. Okay. All right. <laughs> anyway. Uh, so love is the answer at the bottom of the Hebraic living language deck at the uh, top of the other homemade deck that I'm using here. It says that righteous lips are the delight of kings and they love him that speak right. I want to say that was in Sagittarius' reading. Uh, the other card is, uh, this goes with your energy in the zodiac. It says pride goes before destruction and a haughty spirit before a fall. Better it is to be of a humble spirit with the lowly than to divide the spoil with the proud. That's hard energy then. All right, guys. So in the past, we have an innocent infant here showing up. We also have the mob. You could be a part of the mob or something got mobbed or something like that. Something was disorderly here within some type of a populated area or there's just some, something rude and riotous here. All right, and there's a, I just can't deny the truth anymore it took place in the past, but there's some type of a mobbish type of energy, and there was some pride and ego around something. Uh, for some of you all were speaking upright, some people weren't. Some people were trying to say love was the answer, and some people didn't care. They, they spoiled somebody and took their and they divided their spoil with other proudful people. And it says that there's a big coffee uh, drinker here involved in the situation in the past. And there's another scripture coming out for you all. And it says, Restore unto me the joy of my salvation and uphold uh, me with the free spirit. You guys also have free spirit in the zodiac as well. Then will I teach transgressor, transgressors thy ways and sinners shall be converted unto thee. Well, somebody in the past was innocent, but something's here also where a mobbish situation is showing up here, people. Uh, somebody's just like, I can't deny the truth anymore, but, but it's going both ways with y'all. It really is going both ways with y'all. Show me the deep pass or the pass position for Aquarian energy, please. Hold on just a second because I got cards here that's flipping. Show me Aquarian energy because something was rude and disorderly around somebody. And um, 
if one party was being kind, like I said, and the other party wasn't, and this is something to do with the child or something like that, and something here. I know that there was a death that took place because it really was coming out in uh, the last three um, readings that I did for the zodiac signs for these readings. So this just showed up in uh, Capricorn's uh, reading, and this is somebody who has been blocked. This has the fill of the five of wands, which would be like a competition type of energy. Um, but this is the seven of wands, and I'm so sorry for the, um, there we go. Uh, this is the seven of wands, and somebody's got the upper hand here, although all kinds of people have been blocking somebody. So in the past, something's taken place here where somebody was freaking proud. Okay, and some, somebody was having righteous lips or being upright. This is spiritual energy. Maybe saying, look, love is the answer, whatever. But people freaking were just a mob is here. All right? And there's uh, if somebody's infant got trampled within some type of freaking mobbish energy, then that's nasty energy, people. People are proud, and uh, it's nasty. Okay? And somebody's just, after that happened, or I guess for some people, it's just saying, my God, uh, restoring to me the joy of my salvation because I mean the baby or somebody uh, there's an infant here okay I can't get around the, for somebody there's an infant there uh, within a situation where a mob was here and somebody just like I can't deny the truth anymore whatever the freaking truth was uh, and you're part of this mob and in the past you you finally come to from something from maybe deeper past uh, to cry out to the Most High to restore your salvation so that you could teach sinners in the way or somebody did in the connection. This is the past energy, people. And the, what's hidden space is a scripture here that actually came up, I want to say it came up in the um, Capricorn reading. And it says, Have all the workers of iniquity no knowledge who eat up my people as they eat bread and call not upon Jehovah? They were in great fear, for Elohim is in the generation of the righteous. This was either in Sagittarius's or a Capricorn, I can't remember. It was in uh, Capricorn. The sun is shining on something here. The sun is shining on this. And it says, Jehovah uh, sees the proud and the pride falls. Well, we got that right here. That's, that's uh, incredible. And we have a refreshing, healing words of wisdom. And we have somebody righteous uh, over here with lips that are a delight of kings. Or Jehovah's trying to tell you something about your mouth. It says, um, it will be revealed today. Something that's been hidden is going to be revealed today to you. Uh, we also have what's hidden is some type of a learning or in the sense of being received by some type of a doctrine. So somebody is, is secretly learning something and getting out of this crap. That's, that's positive. Something's going to be revealed to somebody in the connection today about that. If you're coming out of being a worker of iniquity because this is disorderly here within this populated mob type energy. Show me what's hidden, please, for um, Aquarius. Show me what's hidden for Aquarius. Thank you. Uh, some, some cut throat is here, people. So if you still are dealing with mobbish energy and somebody is connected to the mob, uh, this card talks about let me see something. So there's secrets here, people. There's a, another woman or uh, there's somebody in your family. We had your cousin showing up. It, those of you who had the same type of cards that are coming up. Um, in the Capricorn or Sagittarius read, I can't remember which one now. Uh, they had they had a family reunion thing going on, and and there was a, a cousin was there, and this is the other woman. This is also the Bet in the Hebrew, uh, which is um, a patriarch of a family. Okay. Um, but this is secrets, and this is high volume understanding by way of your intuition in the upright. Okay, she holds the Torah uh, on her lap, and she would be upright and more honorable. She's a priest. This is a spiritual matter. Was also uh, one of the words that came out in one of those other readings. Uh, something's hidden for somebody. That something's uh, real cutthroat, and something is around somebody that is. Um, if this in the upright. Then there's something secret in the hidden place here that Jehovah's fixing to take somebody out real quick. Okay, this this card talks about uh, an overseer or something like that sending out a knight to get rid of the wicked kind of stuff, and it is because you reap what you sow, man. Okay, something's going to be literally just uh, cut throat. Somebody's detached here. We've got workers of iniquity showing up here. We got the freaking mob showing up. We got secrets, secrets about if you know. 
if what's hidden, the secrets about this was past energy, and that's to show them what's hidden. Somebody's trying to learn from that now, and understanding that Elohim's in the righteous it is in the uh, generation of the righteous, not this crap. Uh, then something will be revealed. But obviously, it's being revealed now. Because something's hidden and secretive. Somebody's on their way to do something here to take somebody out. It's been doing crap. Then okay, that's what's showing here. Uh, what's going to come to the surface? <laughs> Outside of this being revealed today or something else being revealed to you, uh, somebody's going to come and say, well, whatever you need, it's all right with me. I, I want to care for you. Well, some people are upright. Some people are not. Some people are saying love is the answer. Some people aren't. It says, I've been hiding from you in the dark and I've uh, been down. Well, because this crap. If somebody's done something really bad to somebody, okay? If this is at a hotel or a motel or out of state energy or, or other people were out of state because we had a family reunion there. We have a secret person who is listening and we just seen the high priestesses here. Okay? Your Hebrew car is the okay, so the waste look somebody was already killed and murdered and slayed and went to a desolate place. And trampled on, or it was a child that was, or something like that. So we have that energy coming up now. It's like the third or fourth time now. Uh, this has come up in these readings. So give me a card for what's coming to the surface. So this has come to the surface. The slaying energy also that is hidden from somebody. These worker of iniquities. Something's being revealed about this crap this, that's been risen up. This proud energy that will never humble itself. Look. Pride goes before destruction, people, and something's destructive back here, okay? And it's showing it, and what's hidden is somebody either not learning it, or you're going to learn real quick, it's because somebody's coming to slay somebody for slaying somebody else's infant, or something like that, okay? And it's really, really showing itself here, people, it really, really, really is. I had to pause my camera for a second. So what's going to come to the surface is about this waste that happened back here with this freaking mob. Or what's hidden that's going to come to the surface. Is somebody that can get slayed themselves because you reap what you sow. Uh, with whatever this family situation was. And you know we know that the, the mob is called the family. Um, has somebody really been down because something has taken place. Okay and if somebody's come out of that. Uh, then, then that's what's showing then I guess. Show me what's coming to the surface for Aquarius energy. If you're in the upright, I send you love and light. It's hard energy, people. Show me Aquarian energy, please. So, there's your very own energy. There's a spy here. And this also was um, showing up either in the Capricorn or Sagittarius energy. Or maybe it was Scorpio. I don't remember. But there's a spy here. But this, uh, you yeah, know, there's devilish stuff, people, around somebody. There's a real devil here. Well, this is an undercover agent watching something here. All right. This is, this somebody's been tested. This is industry stuff. This is sex, drugs, and rock and roll. All right. And somebody said, whatever you need. If somebody's getting divine grace, and that's what that's showing there. Because somebody's been in the dark hiding because of something real devilish. Uh, then this is communication then about that. Only you know your heart. Um, but this is a secret agent. But this agent or somebody's childish around you or something like that, spying, checking people out. There's somebody also watching this person. A group of people is here as well. Watching this person. There's something devilish here, though, people. I, I don't like your energy. I really just don't like your energy here. Uh, there's somebody that you work with or this is your boss or something took place with your boss or something's just real, just, just over the top, just... A fatal attraction or over the top attraction. This is just a real. This somebody who's either able to pass this freaking test or they're freaking tyrant man and they're on the chain. And what's hidden is somebody gonna rise up and just literally lose their ever loving mind. Uh, the, what's coming to the surface is somebody was somebody was gonna go to jail for what they did. Because they murdered somebody, man. They just murdered somebody. They're, they're just crazy in their freaking head. And love is the answer, people. Yeah, there's wine here. Somebody's a heavy drinker. And something took off with that. And got some type of a mobbish situation. Uh, then that's exactly what's happening. Somebody's in deep marsh here. Really deep marsh. And that, yeah, so this generation here, those children. A river is here. Eternity, a prophet. Inheritance is uh, are here. Faithfulness and salvation. And, and uh, fishing type of energy is here, whatever that means for any given person. All right, well, 
there's a devil here, people. There really is. And there's secrets. I mean, the high priestess is still here. So we're really going to have to use our intuition, Aquarius, because something's real devilish around you. Okay? And somebody's fixing to rise up and take something out. Because pride goes before a destruction. And so destruction is around somebody. And there's secrets about it. So make a good jail. Because we've got people literally coming up on somebody who's, who's checking somebody else out to do whatever they're doing here. That's huge energy, people. And so the, the waste is going to be upon the one who wasted. Is exactly what Elohim is saying here. It says, please show me that you care. It says, when your hands folded inside of mine, it was a perfect fit. And we also have laughter, do it good like a medicine. We have Black Lives Matter, and yes, they do. Um, so anyway, Aquarius, this is what's coming out here uh, on your energy. There's local talent here. The, the vice president is here. And I will tell you, in the Capricorn reading, uh, we had all kinds of global stuff happening, okay? So something's not as secretive as some people think that they are because some people are being watched for the slaying that they've done, okay? It's already being watched. So you've been warned if you're in the negative, if you're in the upright, keep your mouth straight, all right? Because that's uh, something that can go down really big. Shalom.